Good evening, good evening. Good evening. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo están? Miren, no me salieron ustedes ahí en la lista de los pendientes. No eran ustedes de casualidad. Teacher. Hola. Hello, hello. Este, le decía ahí que solo voy a estar de oyente porque voy manejando. No voy a participar. Va. It's okay, Adán, it's okay. Mire, Adán, usted me salía pendiente ahí en las actividades. Sí, hoy que llegue voy a completar eso. Va, perfecto. Si necesita ayuda, ahí me escribe, oiga. Ok, ok. Ok, no problem. And you, Santos, also, right? Or not? No, right? Only one connection. <laughs> mm, yes. It's earlier. So we are going to wait for the rest. No problem. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, my friend. How are you? Let's see. Herbert, Herbert. Let me see. Oh, Herbert, congratulations and good job. You finished the platform, the activities. So good job, my friend. Yes, teacher. Hello, Wilbur. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? How are you today? I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. What about you? I am ready and uh, aprender algo nuevo. <laughs> to learn something new. All right. Excellent. Well, everybody, it's time for me to start the class here. So let's see here. All right. Very good, very good. Excellent, so let me see here. 
Well, good evening to everybody else who has joined the class for here. So I have um, some people here in the class already. Tengo varios de aquí en la clase. Veamos, tenemos ahí. Um, one second. Let's stop right here. All right. So we have Adán, que lo saludamos. Edith Consuelo, very good. Hello. Ever Enrique, hello. En Saúl Ernesto Martínez. Hello, hello. Veamos aquí. Tengo a alguien. Ever, no. Adán, Carlos Alberto Santos. Not here. Saúl Ernesto. Ok, perfect. All right. So, well, everybody, let's start the class right now. So, as you can see, my friends, we are going to... Um, to start the class right here practicing with this tongue twister all right we like the tongue twister so we are going to start practicing with them and this is the first one we have right here it's easy all right so no worries this is easy it says right here good better best never let it rest till your good it's better and your better best. Super easy, right? So you go on this one. One more time. I'm going to repeat it for you so you can check it out, all right? So this one is good, better, best, never let it rest till your good is better and your better best, all right? So one more time. You will see this one right now. Pay attention here. It says good, better, best, never let it rest till your good it's better and your better best. One more time, my friends. It will be good, better, best. Never let it rest. Till your good is better and your better best. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right. So let's see. Right now you will have just a couple of minutes to practice it, right? So, I mean, just one minute, right? Because this is very easy. If you have questions about the vocabulary, please let me know, all right? So we can continue practicing this right now. One more time. Remember. Good, better, best, never let it rest. Till your good is better and your better best. All right, so everybody practicing right now, okay? Practicing, 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 all right? Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, all right, all right. So let's see the rest, the rest, the rest. Right now, just practicing. So let's see here. Very good, very good, excellent. So let's see there. Remember, good, better, best, never let it rest. Still your good is better and your better best. Yay. Mm -hmm. So let's see who else has joined the class. It will be, we have now um, David. Hello, David. We have also Edmundo. Hello, Edmundo. Hello, Hello right. teacher. Good, good evening. Good evening, my good friend. Good to see How you again. You? Thank you. Likewise, how are you today? Uh, my my day was a little bit uh, a little bit hard because I uh, I have to travel to my home from the from the place of my job. Uh, I I was uh, driving all the all the all the afternoon. Okay. Oh, I see, my friend. Well, seems like a busy day, huh? All right. Yes. So very busy. And, and what about the weekend? Are you going to work on the weekend, or are you gonna be just like having a day off? Yes. Uh, uh, is uh, I'll be off the all the weekend. I I'm going to the uh, a party or the town. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah, well, that's nice. That's nice. All right. Great. 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 Excellent. Okay, everybody, so one minute, it's gone already. So we are going to see if you can pronounce this easy tongue twister to begin with the class, right? So let's see. 
the tongue twister here, it says good, better, best, never let it rest till your good is better and your better best. All right. Who wants to be the first volunteer? My friends, tell me. Go ahead. Can I, teacher? Of course, Anundo, go ahead. Then you can select the next person. Tongue twister. Uh -huh. Go, go, okay, go, go, go ahead, Wilbur. No, 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 I said, you go first, Edmundo, and then Wilbur. Okay, thank you. Tongue, tongue twister, good, better, best, never. Let it rest till your good is better and your better best. Thank you very much, my friend. That was actually super good, all right? Thank you. So it's your turn now, um, Wilbur, go ahead. Good, better, best, never let it let it rest till your god is better and your better best excellent good job you know just be careful with this one remember that here it's no god because god is like dios y esto es bueno right so good repeat it good job all right so and then in this one right here lo unimos y se pronunciaría como let it there you go exactly right so but yes. after that super good yes herbert let it Le, let it. Let it. Exactly. It sounds like this way. Voy a intentarlo, teacher. Excellent, Mr. Oya. Go ahead. Good petted bets never little threats hmm. till your good is better and your better bets. Yay. Good job. Excellent. Thank you very much, Mr. Oya. That was actually a super nice job. Remember this one right here, it's let it, let it, let it, right? Repeat it, let it, let it, let there it. you go. Exactly, right? So thank you very much for this one. Okay, excellent. So any other volunteer? Etuvimos at Mundo, uh, Wilbur, and uh, Herbert, all right? So what about the rest? Yeah. Oh, hello, Ever. Evening. Oh, David, and then Ever. Okay, David, uh-huh. Any question? Oh, you have a question, go ahead. Permitir. Let it. Permitir. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. All right. So, Ever, you can try it now. Good, be the best. Never let it rest till your good is better and you'll be the best. Excellent. My friend, usted hizo un buen trabajo pronouncing this better, pero aquí me dijo bitter y aquí también y la misma palabra, right? So, remember, this one is... Good, better, best, never let it rest. Could you produce better, better and you're better? better. Rest. Exactly like that. Super good, Ever. Very good job. All right. Excellent. Thank you very much, my friends. And what about my last volunteer? Who's my last volunteer? Mm -hmm. David. Okay, David. Good job. Good, better, best, never let it rest. Till you good is better and you're better, best. Excellent. Thank you, my friend. That was actually nice as well from you. All right. So, well, everybody, thank you very much for participating in this activity. Um, Commander, somebody says there. All right. Uh, very good. So we're going to continue with the next activity right here, which is going to be a game. All right. So, yes, we are going to play a game. Como hacer equipos, we're going to work in teams right now here. All right. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. All right. Very good, excellent. Here you have it. Thank you. Vamos a ver how many teams can I get here? Cuántos equipos salen? Veamos. We have we have um, twelve people connected, but there's also twelve what who are mine. Three. All right, it's almost nine, right? I guess if I'm not wrong. Okay, well, so let's see here. Vamos a irnos en teams de three teams. All right, so the equipo de tres. There you go. Teams of three. All right, so. Team number one, all right? So, lo vamos a poner así como lo veo yo aquí in this order. We're going to have it in this order. Liam, team number one. One second, veamos. One second, one second. Okay, okay. So, let's see here. There you go. Excellent. Okay. So, take a look at this one, all right? Miren, así veo yo ahorita el listado. All right, so, entonces, ahí vamos a tener a... Um, let's see. One second. Uh, Adam, David, and Edith in one team. 
So then we have team number two, which is going to be Edmundo, Ever, and Herbert. El team number three is going to be Santos, Saul, and Wilder. Okay. Entonces quedamos así. El blue, el red, el blue, and the green. Okay. Yes. There we go. All right. So we have the red team, the blue team, and the green team. Oops. Okay. Green team. Green team. Excellent. Thank you very much. And now we can change the screen again so we can see the game. Okay. Very good. So let's see. Empezamos con el red team right here. Del red team tengo a, uh, I have Adam, David, and Edith. ¿Quién va a ser primero? My friends, to select a question right here. Mm -hmm. Yo creo que del red team solo David. Ah, uh, Adam or David. <laughs> Va, how about David? David, David? Teacher, uh, don't worry, it's not the... the, the no worries, no worries. Ahorita vamos a empezar and uh, we're going to start right now. Ya ahorita le explico bien, all right? Yes, David? David, David? Okay, teacher. Okay. David, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Very easy, right? So, aquí we have uh, five categories. Category number one, two, three, four, and five, right? ¿Qué tiene que hacer usted? This is the same for everybody. What do you have to do? It's very simple. Ustedes vienen y escogen first una category. You choose one category first, all right? Solo una de esas five. And then uh, you continue with this one right here, right? You select one of those questions. Una de estas preguntas. Cuando usted escoja una de estas preguntas, you select one of those questions, eh, responde la pregunta, and you answer the question, and if you do it correctly, si lo hace bien, se va a llevar los puntos que está aquí. You are going to get the points that you see there. Understand? Yes or no, my friends? Yes, teacher. Okay. Selection. Um... Excellent. All right, so... Ajá, entonces le toca ahorita al primer equipo que es el red, and that will be, eh, in this case, um, let me see, Adam, Edith, and David, pero Adam va driving, así que le toca a David, driving, right, David? Driving. Teacher, uh, countable or uncountable? Countable or uncountable, all right? 100, 200, 300, 400, or 500. ¿Cuánto quiere? How many points do you want? 100. 100. Let's see. Money, my friend. Countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Uncountable. Vamos a ver. Yes, uncountable. So, 100 points for the red ones. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Very good. Excellent. The blue team. The blue team, it's going to be Edmundo, Ever, and Herbert. Who is going to participate right now? Mm -hmm. Ever. Ever. Okay, ever. Hello, ever. In uh, um, white car. White car. Oh, okay. Gonna the white car, my friends, are crazy questions. All right. So you have to look for the information, right? Así que aquí las questions son para la like general information. No quiere cambiar, my friend? You want the white car? Um, Tom or any? Tom or any, but uh, yeah, that's easier. All right, one, two, three, four, or five hundred. Um, and how hundred? This one. Eh, trescientos. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Is three hundred. Y three hundred. Okay, three hundred points. Stop. You don't need onions in that recipe. The answer is some or any. Stop. Uh, you don't need blah, 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 onions in that recipe. Some or any. Herbert, el mundo no le puede ayudar ni Wilbur. All right? El mundo de Wilbur, you cannot you help. <laughs> onions. Some. 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 Onions in the recipe. 
Song? Herbert? Mm. Song, song. Okay, excellent. Well, in that case, let's see the correct answer. It's any. All yes. right, so why Un it's tostero, any? Eh? Because it is negative. Ah, es cierto, era negativa, tenía que ser Ani. <laughs> exactly. Well, no worries, no worries. So no point for the blue team. Let's see the green team. The green team, it's just like Santos, Saul, and Wilbur. All right, so uh -huh. who is available to participate? Mm -hmm. so, Santos. I am ready, teacher. Okay, Wilbur, go ahead, my friend. Which one? What category? Much or, or money? Much or many? How many points do you want? Uh -huh. 100. 100. Okay, very good. How, blah, 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 floor do I need to make muffins? Much or many, my friend? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no connection. Hello, much. hello. Much, teacher. Much. Okay, let's see. Yes, much. So 100 points for the green team. Very good, very good. Excellent. Good job, good job. So let's see. Let's continue with the next one right here. All right. Now let's go again with the red team which is uh, adam david or david who's going to participate now adam or or david teacher hello okay edith okay Help me, um, make the question for the answer make the question for 500. the answer 100 okay remember aquí le vamos a dar la respuesta we're going to give you the answer and you have to make the question. Okay, Edith? Yes. Okay, 100 points. Yes, I have some tomatoes. Uh -huh. What is the correct answer? What is the question here? Tick tock, tick tick tock. Ah. Uh -huh. Edit connection lost. Aquí estoy. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the answer? <laughs> Tell me. Auxilio. <laughs> yes, team. All right, what happens with the team? I have some tomatoes. What's the question? ¿Cuál es la, cuál es la pregunta? I uh I have something. Está usando como din. Ajá, ajá, ajá. Sí. La llamada, la llamada. <laughs> yes. La llamada, la llamada. El 50 y 50. 50 and 50, you said, right? 50, 50. Como din, como din, teacher. Okay. Tick tock, tick tock. Okay, ten seconds more. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. I have five. some tomatoes. Excuse me. Yes, I have tomatoes. Ajá, cabal. Está recibiendo ayuda. We all can hear that. Era el comodín nada más. Es que el yes no se miraba. Estaba hasta atrás. Pero igual necesito el comodín. Respuesta, respuesta. Porque sí es afirmativa, ¿verdad? Pero... Yes, I have some tomatoes. ¿Qué es la pregunta? Sí, son tomates, vea. Contable. Okay, well, time's up. 
What happens in this one? Es que desde el principio, have you got any tomatoes? Usted tiene que crear la question. All right, so like Be that. Sure. Can, can, I, can I say, uh, do you have tomatoes? La hubiera valido, of course. All right, I but I, it would have to be, do you have any tomatoes, for example? Do you have any tomatoes? Mm -hmm. yeah. Exactly, yes, I have some tomatoes. All right, so yes, that's actually what happens. But thank you, no worries, all right, you're fine. So let's see. Okay. Let's go with the, tenemos más rondas, we have more rounds, no worries. Uh, well, Edmundo, Ever, or Herbert? Uh-huh. Me, Most teacher. Okay, go for it. How many points, my friend? Uh, countable or, or uncountable. Okay. 500. 500. You go for the big ones. There you go. Information, my friend. Countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Uncountable. Final answer? Final answer. Okay, cool. Uncountable. Yes, that's correct. So you got 500 points. Oh my God, people. Blue team is winning. All right. So now let's go with the last one right here, which is uh, Santos, Saul, or Wilber. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What is it? Huh? For the Anguars. Which one? Much money. Oh. Much or many. Okay, much or many. And how many points? Mm -hmm. Come on, Mr. Arias. Come on. Come on, get the Mr. Arias. I guess Bye, yeah. yes. connection issues. Co come on, come on, Ricky. Ah. <laughs> and what about like Saul, huh? Saul, you are there, participate. I saw you now in the cameras, uh-huh. Okay, good chair. Tell me what category do you prefer? Mm -hmm. Go, go, go. I don't understand. All right, no problem. So we'll please pay attention right now. Right, we have here five categories. Tenemos cinco categorías. Much, or sorry, some or any, much or many. Make the question for the answer, countable or uncountable. All right? Countable aquí, or uncountable. Okay? Very good. Entonces, aquí hay disponibles 200, 300, or 400 points. Which one do you 200. want? 300. Okay, excellent. Two, two, two. two. Oh, two. Okay, 200. Two. Yes. People, countable or uncountable, Saul? Uncountable. Final answer? Yes. That's so, it. one more time. What is the answer? Can you repeat the answer, Saul? Uncountable, teacher. Uncountable. Okay, let's see if it's uncountable. Oh, my goodness. Uncountable. All right. So, would that be correct? Yes or no, people? Very good. Uncountable. Okay. There you go. So this one is the green team here. You got 300 points there. There you go. Excellent. Thank you. So you go on the next one. Next, everybody here. Uh -huh. That's going to be for Adam, David, or Edith. Can I teach her? Good evening, teacher. Uh -huh. Present. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's okay. All right, so then the equipo de Adán, ¿quién más puede participar? Who else can participate? What happens with David? Can I teach him? Of course, mister, tell me. What category do you want? Match or many, teacher. 
match or many, how many points? 500. Excellent. You need to put spices in a pork vindaloo, but not too salt. Aquí es respuesta doble. Es doble much, doble many, or much egg many. Mm -hmm. What do you think? You need to put many space in a pork. ¿Cómo lo pronuncia ahí? Vindalú, ¿cómo es? Vindalú, yes. Vindalú, but not too much salt. Ok, so, ¿cuál era la primera? Sorry, no le escuché, ¿qué me dijo? For, I could, can you repeat it? Many. Put many spices and much salt. Many much, right? Yes. Ok, let's verify. Okay. Many and much. Very good job for the red ones. 500 points. Good, 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 good. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. All right. And then let's go with the next one, which is going to be um, Edmundo Ever or Herbert. Mm -hmm. Enrique. Okay. Me. Go ahead, man. All right. Me, teacher. Ahead, tell me, please. It's difficult. The last... Don't see categories. Which one? One second. Oh, sorry. That is the stock. Uh huh. Which category? Countable or uncountable. Okay. 300 or 400? 400. 400. Okay. Asparagus, countable or Asparagus. Yes. Asparagus. Uh -huh. Asparagus. Countable. Countable. Final answer? Final answer. Oh. oh, my God. My God. Well, no worries. We still have more questions. All right. So. Let's see. In no. the last round here, <laughs> we go for this one. No, 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 Wilbur, it's your turn. Okay, I am ready, teacher. Okay, go ahead, my friend. Countable or uncountable? Countable or uncountable. Very good job. Excellent. So, well, 300, right? This is the only one who we have there. Hair. Mm -hmm. Easy, easy. Cabello, yes, uh, it's uncountable. Of course, my friend, uncountable, all right? Very good job, excellent. So we got this one for the green team here. Excellent, all right? There you go. Let's just go with the red one again, all right? So the red one again. Edit, 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 edit. Are you there, edit? Oh, oh, hi, hi, hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So let's see. <laughs> uh, some water here. Uh, um. Uh, 100 some or uh, any? Some or any, 100. Yeah. All right, excellent. So, have uh, you got any or some sugar? Uh, Tom. Edit. Cincuenta, cincuenta. So what happened? So what is it? 
Mm -hmm. have, you, have, have you got any sugars? Mm -hmm. um. Some or any? That's the question. Some or any? Mm -hmm. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Alguien del team que le ayude. Saúl, Adam. Teacher, have you got any sugar? Any sugar? Any. Final? Any. Any. Okay. Any sugar. Yes, because it's a question, right? So yes, absolutely. So we're going this one for the red ones. Okay. Now it's time for the blue ones. Aha, uh -huh, blue. Who goes now? Me, teacher. Okay, Edmundo, go ahead. Uh, some or any. How many points? Five, five hundred. Excellent. Oh. So double, oh my double, God. my friend. Would you like tea? I think I have in my cupboard. Would you like any tea? I think I have some in the cupboard. Oh. Final answer. Final answer. No changes. Sure? No changes. You sure? Yes. You wanna bet? <laughs> no, I, I don't want to bet. <laughs> okay, let's do something. If your answer is correct, I will double the points. But if your answer is incorrect, I will take the points away. <laughs> Let me check. I, I, I can do. <laughs> I do. Uh -huh. I know. Let me know when you're ready. Would you like any tea? Mm -hmm. In the second part? I think I have... Time mm -hmm. over, Lucha. Time over. <laughs> Time is over. Okay. So... You yeah. said any and some, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. That's uh, in Maybe. Some, some. Some, some. Yes. Or some, some. But it, the, the example is, oh, okay. Some, yes. Some. It is a question. It is a question, See, of course. It right? is a question, but, but I, um, would you like? Um, it's, it's, it's an offer. Exactly. 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 Yes. Oh, my God. You remember now, Edmundo. Yeah. Thank you. Anyway, no puedo, only 50. All right, so thank you. Let's see. The last one, the last one. Vamos con la última, que sería para Wilber, Santos o Saúl. All right, so. Mm -hmm. Who is going to go for that one? Saúl? Está en duda, Wilber. <laughs> Mr. Saúl? Mr. Saúl, go ahead. The white wow. car. All right, all right. All. Okay. All is difficult. No, it's not difficult. Real, you can choose this one. One of those two. This is the easiest one. United does the fast, right? Try it. Mr. Saul, uh, you or, or me? Okay, teacher. Okay. Um, much or any? Mm -hmm. 200. Easy. Whoa. Oh, man. The microphone, man. Many. 
How? Bitch, it's a word. Give me time, please. <laughs> we don't have too much. <laughs> time is over. <laughs> easy, easy. Um, much, teacher? Much. Okay, much. Okay, March. final answer. Oh my God, it's countable. All right. So. <laughs> yeah, look at it, Mundo. <laughs> All right, so let's see, let's see. All right, that's fine. So, to get on parejos, actually, take a look at this one right here. So, we have the green team, 600 points, the blue team, 500 points, and the red team, 700 points. Good job. Super good job. You like it. You did it very good right here. All right. Thank you. Thank you for participating in this activity, my friends. That was actually super nice from you. All right. So now let's just go ahead and review, a, you know, a new topic, which is very easy. All right. So and we need to just take a look at this one right here. Okay. Now we are going to talk about something that we have been practicing. We just have to remember this, which is the present perfect tense. All right. Do you remember the present perfect tense, my friends? Yes or no? Hello? Okay. What is the present perfect? So the present perfect, normally you use it when we're talking about experiences, all right? So something that you have done, I hope you said, yeah, ISO, right? And normally you represent it right here with these auxiliaries, have, that you're gonna be using have with this uh, subject. So you have right here, I, you, we, and they, and then the past participle of the verbs, all right? So that is actually how you use it. So for example, in here, you go on this one, it says, if you wanna say, yo, Let's say, for example, one second here in this one. All right. So it said like, yo he visto esa película. If you want to check it like that. All right. So yo he visto esa película. In English, would be something like, how do you say primero? Yo. ¿Cómo se dice yo, my friends? How do you say yo? I. 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 Right. How do you say e? Es aquí donde viene el auxiliar have or has. All right. Ese e que quiero dar a entender ahí sería uno de esos dos. Have or has. All right. Yes, have. Para, el, para el I, ¿cuál sería? Have or has. Have. Have. Ah, have. Muy bien. Have. So, I have. Y lo have. Que usar, I have to use the past participle of the verb y that I'm checking. What's the past of watch? ¿Cuál sería el pasado participio de watch? Watch. Watch which is con ed, right? So, I have watched. Yeah, watch. Uh-huh, I have watched. ¿Cómo sería ahí? That movie. Very That's good. Movie. I have watched. That movie. That what? movie. Like that one, all right? Take a look at that one. So, it's just like that. I have watched that movie. Yeah. All right, so, is it clear? Yeah, it's clear. So, you can say this one right here. All right, or for example, if you want to say, estamos hablando de la third person, que sería he, she, it, podemos decir, right? Ella ha Us. ido a la playa. All right, so, and we want to check it right here. So it's going to be, first of all, ella, how do you say ella? She. She. She, el she a para has. ella, ¿cómo sería? She has. She has, she has. ido. She has. Gom. Gone. Para pasado gone. participio de go, it's gone. It has, go. it has gone to the beach. The beach. beach. To All right. The exactly. Beach. So you see, that is actually how you use it. All right. Is it clear? She has. It's clear, it's clear teacher. It's clear. For me. It's clear. Okay, fine. Los demás tienen preguntas. Va quedando claro. Is it clear? No yes, question. teacher. Clear, no teacher. Okay, very good. Excellent. So let's just continue now then with this one, which is going to be the negative section. All right, let's do this one right here. For the negative section, we have here the same structure. Primero el sujeto, luego el auxiliar. El auxiliar ya sería aquí haven't or hasn't. Right, so dependiendo de con qué grupo de sujetos lo estoy usando, depending on what is the group of subjects I'm using here. All right, so then the past participle at the end. 
So, and then we go and toss this with this one right here. How do you say, for example, yo no he viajado a Estados Unidos. All right, so how do you say that in, in, in English, my friends? I have not, oh, I, I have I have not. I can use the contract. I haven't. Uh -huh. I, haven't. I haven't. Travel. Very good, travel. To USA. 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 Very good. Excellent. Remember que la abreviación en Spanish sería Estados Unidos and in this one is USA in English, right? So, like that one. Very good. So, then, if you want to say, for example, eh, I can change los, los uh, sujetos, I, you, we, they, he, she, it, and I can give names, nombres, right? So, for example, how do you say Messi no ha jugado uh -huh, like that Messi no ha jugado Messi has has Messi play 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 y ahí la dejamos pero vamos a dejar ahí all right so like that play very good people Messi is coming to El Salvador all right so let's watch Messi all right and then you go on the next one. Um, questions at the moment for the negative? No question for me, teacher. No questions? All right, excellent. So then you go on this one right here. I'm also going to question. Let's go with the question. With the questions, well, we have to change the position, right? So, for example, if you pay attention right here, all right, so ahora lo primero es el auxiliar, right? So the first thing is the auxiliary. After that one, we go with the subject, right? And then the verb in a uh, past participle and super important, it's a question. So we have to add the question mark at the end. All right. So if you don't write the question mark, so then it's not a question, of course, right? And then we go on this one. So we have this example right here. So let's see. When it comes to this one, um, how do you say, for example, has visto esa película? Has visto esa película? How do you say that one? Hmm? Uh, have you have you have you watched that movie? Yes. Have you watched that movie? Have you watched that movie? Have you watched that movie? Question mark. And the question mark is super important, right? Remember, in español, is eh, correct to use ambos signos, right? But in English, solo va al final. In English, will you use it at the end? All right, so then you go on this one right here. Now, eh, let's go on this one right here. In here, how do you say? Eh, ha comido ella pizza? How do you say that? Has she? Ha ha she eaten ella pizza? Has she? Eating has she eaten pizza and the question mark right there. So then we have the examples. All right. So this is how we are doing it. All right. So uh, questions about that, my friends? Has she eaten pizza? Questions? No questions? No question. No, no question. Peter. Uh, Mr. Lucha, please uh, capture the picture. <laughs> a screenshot. A screenshot. Screenshot. The, the, the screen the screenshot yeah all right <laughs> right now right now mr will mr rivas thank you my friend thank you very very much good boy is mr lucha <laughs> okay thank you thank you thank you <laughs> all right so you guys are funny all right so let's continue with this one right here and now let's see Okay, um, if you don't have questions for this one, now let's just review this one right here. Ahora, vamos a ver algo aquí, which is, which is important here, which is how do we compare the past simple and the present perfect? El simple past, ya lo hemos visto. El past simple, we have checked that before, right? Verbs en pasado, yo fui, yo comí, yo estuve, yo vi, etc. Right? So, I went, I was, I ate, etc. So what's the difference? So this is something that we need to understand right here. So the first one right here is gonna be very simple, right? 
So this one right here, in el pasado simple, es el sujeto y el verbo in past. All right, so el pasado simple, the simple past, or past simple here, express finish time. All right, so it's an activity that already finished in the past. So ya pasó. For example, this is here. We live in Japan from this time to this time. All right, esta actividad o esta activity ya pasó. Nosotros vivimos en Japón. De tal año a tal año. We live in Japan from 1995 to 1998. All right? Una acción que está finished. All right? So like that finished. one. Very good. Excellent. So, and then you go with the next one. El simple past also refers to a definite time. All right? Igual el pasado, tiempo definido. Yo vi la Torre Eiffel en tal fecha. All right? I saw the Eiffel Tower in 20, I'm sorry, in 2007. All right, so then, in indicate series of finished actions, all right? Series de acciones o rutinas en pasado, right? First, he read, he read the book, and then he watched the movie, and then you continue. For example, como cuando se te pregunta, when you are, are asked the question, what did you do yesterday? Y empezas, yesterday, I took a shower, I visited my mother, I went to work, etc., 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 right? And then we have the present perfect. Eso que acabamos de ver. Present perfect, right? So the structure. When are we going to use the present perfect? The present perfect right here, it's going to be to describe unfinished uh, time, right? Aquí no hemos terminado. Solamente empezamos and we refer cuando empezamos, for example. Este I here is la contracción de I have. So I it's the contraction of I have. Then we go on this one. I have worked as a teacher since 2011, right? No he terminado. Yo estoy trabajando todavía as a teacher, right? For example, it says right that one here. Um, if I want to ask you, let's say, for example, veamos, if I ask you, Edmundo, right? So, uh, for how long have you been working as an officer, right? So, you said, like, I have worked as an officer since, and you mentioned. Uh, I, 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 I've been working. Uh since uh, 1988. Uh, uh, 88, all right. So, but remember, Mundo, there is not I have been working. Seria, I have worked. Because you're saying, I have trabajado. Ah, okay, uh, yes. This is, uh, this is past, uh, present perfect continuous. Yeah. That's correct. All right, yeah. and then you go with this one. I refer to in definite time, I have seen the Eiffel Tower. Aquí, my friends, yo estoy hablando de la experiencia. Yo vi a Torre Eiffel, but I don't refer when I did it. Solamente digo, I did it. Lo hice, right? So, for example, how do you say, yo he visto esa película? Lo acabamos de ver. I watched the, that movie. I have watched that movie. Exactly, right? So, I didn't say when, no dije cuando, ni donde. I just said, I did it, right? So, I have watched the movie. And then, express experience or result, right? For example, ella... Uh, this, ella ya ha visto esa película tres veces, right? If you want to talk about like that, for example. All right, questions about this? No questions, teacher. No questions? Okay, let's go for a quick exercise right here, my friends. And let's just go ahead and check here. Okay. So let's see. Here we have 10 questions. So we can actually work on this one, all right? So the first one here, you have the verbs between parentheses. If it is negative, you will have a not right here. Or if it is a question, you will see the question mark at the end, all right? So let's say this one. For example, number one, it says it is negative and the verb is work. So I have not worked today. That's the answer for number one, all right? Number two, it says we have... It's affirmative, so we go with have. Uh huh. Bo. What? Uh huh. Bo. A new lamp. A new lamp. Very good. Excellent. And that's the answer. All right. Very good. So the number three, it's negative. So it will be we haven't. Haven't. Plan. Plan. Our holiday yet. Mm -hmm. All right, very good, awesome. The number four, it's a question. What would be the correct structure right here? Where have you been? 
Exactly. Have you been? Which is the past participle of the verb to be. Very good. Excellent. So then we will see this one. Uh, oh, antes de seguir, my friend. I know at Mundo you understand this topic perfectly. So that's why you give me the answers. Pero me gustaría saber si los demás también vamos entendiendo el tema. Solo para saber si no repito. All right. So, uh -huh. everybody else? He um, has. Uh -huh. He has grow five letter. He has. Sorry. Has road. Five letters. Five letters. Okay. Then I have to ask a question. What's the past participle of write? Writing. Aha. Uh -huh. Este es el pasado simple. Entonces sería aquí written. Lo que usamos pasado participio. Past participle. All right. Okay. Very good. Excellent. So, but yeah, the structure, it's okay. All right. Anybody else who can help me with that one? She hasn't. She hasn't. She hasn't. She hasn't. She hasn't, hasn't, hasn't been, been him for a long time. All right. She Very good. Been. Excellent. Then we have a question again. All right. So what's the structure for the question? Have you been at the school? Uh -huh. Have you been at the school? Exactly. So we start with this one. Have you Are been you? at the school? All right. Mm -hmm. So then we have a negative with the verb start. So that will be. School hasn't. Started. 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 Yet. Yet. Very good. Excellent. So then again, we have a question. What's the question? Has, has he has spoken he, to, to his boss? Right. So has. Well, it has to be capital. Has he. Has she. Has spoken. He, Spoken as he spoke. Uh -huh, exactly because it's he is here, here, all right. Very good, excellent. So, no, and the he, last one, no, no, he have mm, has no, he has has him has him has him has him has There you go, all right, excellent. Okay, so teacher, can I share this uh, screenshot? Of course, you can. Okay, no problem. Mm -hmm. And thank you very much, by the way, for it, helping me. All right, so great, excellent. Thank you very much. All right, so that's this one right here. So, questions, my friends? No question, teacher. No questions. All right, well, let me tell you, okay? We got 10, nos sacamos 10. Excellent, all right, great. All the answers are correct. So thank you very much for helping me with this one right here. All right, excellent. So do you have more questions, vocabulary? I hope I get all clear here. All clear, teacher, for me. All clear? Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. All right. I already uh, share. All the all the screenshot on the chat uh, on the WhatsApp group. Thank you very much on this one. All right. Okay, excellent. So, well, we are going to uh, continue with this last activity right here. Okay, so and then we got here the same thing. All right. It says red. Blue and green. And green. All right. Excellent. So take a look, my friends. Aha, a new one, a new one, a new one. <laughs> All right. Excellent. So, but we will see this one. Vamos a ver esta category. All right. So, vamos, no vamos a hacerlo de equipos. We are not going to do it as a team, right? Porque la que vayamos viendo. We're going to do it together and we are going to focus on this category, whatever si entendimos like the difference, okay? Uh, let's see this one. Vamos a hacerlo sin equipos, no worries, okay? So, let's just select the next one, the first one, let's go in that order. Aha, uh -huh. what would be the correct one right here? Uh, have you ever, have you ever uh, eaten sushi? 
eating sushi exactly right so that would be like the correct answer here all right so it will be have you ever eaten sushi porque determinamos que era present perfect because of this one ever right so which is normally the auxiliary that we're going to use ever enrique <laughs> oh my god all right so let's see there you go this one we have the next one number two i darara to the party last night present perfect or simple past simple but i didn't i didn't i didn't go to i the didn't party go last night. You know, como sabe mr edmundo que es simple past well the secret last is night. here last night all right it's a noche all right so and let me see if it is the correct answer so we can check it out didn't go exactly all right so you go on this one didn't go as well all right excellent so let's just continue with this one right here and uh, let me clean this thing here let's go on this one she already see that movie all right so what she is has it? She, already, she has already seen that movie she has already seen that movie very good job excellent also then she has already seen all right that movie all right very good so we identified that one let's just go on this one right here this one i in this house for 10 years i really like it Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I I have uh, I have lived in this house for ten years. I have lived in ten years. Uh -huh, in this house for ten years, right? Very good, very good, very good. So we go on this one. I want to see if this is the correct answer. So let's see. Have lived. That's it. All right. So exactly lo que necesitamos ahí. Have lived. Very good, excellent. So, and let's see the last one. The last one says is here's how you feel when you, uh-huh. What's the correct one? Mm -hmm. That's a difficult one, huh? A difficult, yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, will that be? Simple how past. do you how do you, how do you feel uh -huh. when you when you when you were at the uh, audition? Let's see if what you told us is true. Yay, that's correct. You got it right. So, did you feel when you were at the audition? All right. So we go on this one right here, and that's basically here. Uh, this one here. Now let's just go ahead and check this one. Quickly right here, y veamos lo de los verbos, so because that's important as well, quickly, right? So let's see, what's the past simple and the past participle of the verb? Be, eat, and sing. ¿Cuál sería el simple past de be? Being. The simple past be. de be? Being. No, be. simple past, the simple past. Ah, ese, ese es, uh, was, was, and where. Was, and where. And where? One second here. And where? All right. Excellent. Was and where? Oops. We're missing the, the E there. All right. Was and where? And the past participle? Are you see? Bean. Bean. Right. Bean. So, very good. Excellent. So, what is the simple pass of it? Eight. 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 A simple past, remember, right? What is the past? Uh, the past participle. Eating. 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 Very good. Excellent. And the past, the simple past of C. So. So. In this, the past participle. Sin. So. Sin. Very good. Excellent. Well, I estamos All right. So. Thank you very much, my friends. I really appreciate the fact that, that you were uh, connected to the class. Agradezco mucho su responsabilidad por conectarse y, of course, hayan participado en the activities that you have participated in the activities tonight, right? Los que están presentes de plataforma, por favor, trabajemos en la platform porque mañana es last day, remember, right? So, Mr. Iglesias, plataforma, please. 
All right, so. Eh, okay, teacher, lo ponemos ahí en eso. Thank you very much, my friend. No sé si quiero ver before you go. Let me see here one second. And you go on this one. Mira, era, quien era? Let me see. Okay. Ya dijimos Mr. Iglesias, Carlos Santos, me le dicen, please. Carlos Edgardo Cruz, Franklin de la O, que no está, y Mónica Iber Merino, so please, solo ustedes faltan. Teacher, I am here present. Mr. de la O, hello. I am here, ah, Santa Marino. Este... Uh, please, uh, sorry. <laughs> no worries, Mr. Este, please, la platform, teacher. oiga. Teacher, si me escucha. Yes, Enrique. Sí, me sacó una vez la, el internet, pero aquí estoy siempre. All right, para no worries. Que me no ponga worries. asistencia, por favor. Yes, no worries. Aria no Valle, worries. Santos Mauricio, por eh, En mi caso también lo mismo, teacher. Venía conduciendo y no me podía conectar hasta que logré conectarme. That's fine, that's fine. No worries, right? Igual todo que registrado here in Zoom. Everything is recorded in Zoom, all right? See you tomorrow. Yeah. I mean, no tomorrow, no, on Monday. Oh, my God. See you on Monday. Oh, Take care. Uh, See you Monday. Enjoy your weekend, teacher. You too. Bye -bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.